Hi, who are you and why are you here? Hey. We're Carmen Simon and Craig Rasky and dog. Jake's dog is <laughs> Monk. We represent the new nuclear family. Uh, <laughs> fantastic. Um, we're here actually with uh, Community Not Commodity in response to the uh, Scott Wiener and Mumsy's removal of the benches here in Harvey Milk Plaza. Castro Benefits um, District. Castro Benefits District. Castro Benefits District. Um, and so we really feel that Harvey Milk had a strong um, uh, commitment to preserving the rights of homeless queer youth. And so in response to them removing the benches, we built a bench and have installed it semi-permanently. Is that what you're sitting on? Yes. yes. Oh, look at that. It's amazing. Yes. Reclaimed wood, very uh, sustainable, full Fantastic. of concrete, uh, weighs about 300 pounds. I and heard it's uh, adhered to the plaza with uh, uh, construction adhesive. Nice. I heard that the original benches cost forty thousand dollars to build and put in, and one thousand eight hundred dollars to take out. Yes. How how much would you estimate your bench project cost? Thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. <laughs> Pretty and good. Labor. Yeah. Fantastic. Um, would you like to say anything else about uh, this this space and and why why we're here today? Yeah. I mean, the history of San Francisco has gone through a trajectory of different movements, right? So before this was Harvey Milk Plaza, it was indigenous space at one point. It was earth space. Um, it's all kinds of space. And so the statement is, you know, in the spirit of someone who honored the public, who honored public space, and who also honored the right to convene in public, because Harvey was actually against sit lie laws, um, or so we can call it in, in media. Um, you know, we're here, um, as someone who's born in San Francisco, and plans to stay here for a while, I think the city has a legacy that's better than diesel trains right behind you. <laughs> I think it's a legacy that's bigger and better than um, <laughs> um, It's the legacy, you know, of a bunch of people with a dog, getting filmed with someone with glasses. <laughs> <laughs> And I so, think the overall message is that, um, you know, I know for us as activists, queer uh, activists, that uh, community needs to uh, be put as a priority over our commodification of the area, of the plaza, of the space, of yeah. people. And yes. So that's why we're here. That's why we're yes. here. Yes. What would you like to see happen with the plaza? Um, I'd like to see it be reclaimed by the community and used for the community. And I would like the uh, people currently occupying the Castro to take the time and reflect on the history that which Carmen touched on and actually appreciate the fact that we have public space to congregate in. Sweet. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.